Welcome. In this video, we will take a look at Hella Tuxen's diving performance in the 10-meter final at the European Games 2023. Have fun! She's getting ready to perform her first jump of the final. This is a back two and a half somersaults in the pike position with a difficulty of 2.9. She needs to hit this absolutely on point to get a good start in this competition. That was definitely not the start she was aiming for. It seems like she under-rotated quite a bit, which caused that splashing at the impact. There we can see it one more time. Let's see what the scorecards say. She gets 52.2 points for her first dive, which is not the best result. But hey, she can still improve on the next ones. For now, she's in 10th place in a field of 12 competitors. Okay, time for the second dive. This is an arm stand back two somersaults, one and a half twists with a difficulty of 3.2. It's definitely not an easy dive to get right. I'm very curious to see her performance on this one. Sadly, this attempt was not very good. She under-rotated even more than in the first dive, and the splashing was much bigger. Now we can see it better. She's not straight enough on the impact. Yeah, that's not very good, but keep in mind that this was a very hard dive. This still keeps her in 10th place. Dive number three. This is an inward three and a half somersaults in the tuck position with a difficulty of 3.2. Again, a very hard dive. What? That was like the biggest fountain ever. The airtime looked good, but she couldn't extend her body fully before the impact. It doesn't look that bad in the replay though. I feel kind of sorry for her. I hope that she would do better in this lineup. But we have to remember that she's going against very strong competitors, which is a fact. Still in 10th place after three rounds. I think at this point, it is nearly impossible for her to get into that top five region with just two remaining rounds. Now she has to focus herself up for the fourth round Maybe she can get some important points that can improve her placement significantly. This is a reverse two and a half somersaults in the tuck position with a difficulty of 2.8. That looked pretty good in my opinion, except for the big splash, which is her biggest problem. I'm interested to see the scores on this one. Also, just 50.4 points. I thought this one could have scored higher, but I'm sure the judges know way better than I do. Now she's down to 12th place. She's surely not happy about that. Last chance, Hella. If she's able to perform a good last dive, then maybe she's not ending up in last place. Let's hope for the best. This is a back two and a half somersaults, one and a half twists in the pike position with a difficulty of 
That's another very hard one. I hope she does well. Unfortunately, that was not it. I can already predict at this point that it won't be enough to push her further up in the final standings. Man, I really feel for her. This was just not her best showing. I'm sure she will have great performances in the future where she will place way higher. Here we can see the final standings, where she ended up in 12th place, like I predicted earlier. Show some love by liking the video and subscribe to my channel for more fascinating content.